You know, one of the biggest mistakes I see in early stage pitches is a lot of first time entrepreneurs like to err on the side of being incredibly comprehensive in a pitch and think of it much more like a business plan. And I, I actually advise completely the other way around in that a pitch is much more like a combination of a conversation and a movie trailer. Keep in mind, especially as you move down the stack from people that are very casual investors to professional investors, you know, professional investors are seeing sometimes five, 10 investments per day. And so the real question is, as they're narrowing down the funnel and they're going to bed that night, what's that one meeting they had that they can't stop thinking about it and that perked their interest? So I, I often go through decks with entrepreneurs and cut 90% of the material. And, and, and when the goal is what's going to perk someone's interest and make someone begging to un ask more questions and be memorable rather than do I understand the inside and out of this business, the pitch comes across really, really differently. So I think that, that that's the biggest mistake I see people make is not thinking about my goal is to interest you, not to tell the entire story. If I look at a lot of first time decks and as they iterate through, the biggest changes that I generally see myself recommending is one, keeping the elevation really high, which is, you know, there's three main things you need to communicate, which is, you know, is this real and, and does it work, you know? And the second one is, does this matter? It is an important thing. And the third one is, can you win? And so a lot of the first couple slides, I generally take a 40 slide deck and condense it down to 12, maybe 13 slides. And it's really about, you know, is this a problem that you can relate to? Do you understand that problem? Do you have a unique solution? Is your team have a strategic advantage why this is the right team to solve that problem? And is, is this an important thing? And the rest of the details, we often pull those out and stick it in the appendix. You know, even the financial information at the early stages is really just an Excel exercise. And so a lot of those details, unless you actually have real early momentum and traction, are just numbers. Move the details into the back, into the appendix, or pull them out completely.